Ixia, born and raised as a Sun Hunter, is also the boss of the Outlook group, Bad Soul. Everyone thinks she should act like one, violent and solve everything with fists. However, Ixia doesn't want to be restrained by the definition. And because of this upbringing, she always had a negative view of Iridisho, the neighboring kingdom that represented everything she was not. In her opinion, people in Iridisho were stubborn, condescending and arrogant, but it all changed when she met Leila. Through her interactions with Leila, a person of Iridisho, Ixia discovers valuable qualities within their community, including sacrifice and a fight for a greater cause. Skills. Ixia is a physical marksman with the ability to hit multiple enemies at the same time. First skill, Ixia fires an energy beam in an area to deal damage and slow enemy heroes. Upon hitting, she will gain movement speed for 2 seconds. Meanwhile, enemies that are hit at the center part will receive double damage. Second skill, Ixia unleashes a canister of Starloom energy in a direction that can pull enemies in the center and stun them for a short time. If the enemy is near the base, they will be pushed just like the battle spell Flameshot. Ultimate, Ixia summons her weapon to deal damage in a cone-shaped area for 5 seconds. During this state, her other skills will have a longer range, and she can hit 6 targets at the same time using her basic attacks. While in this state, she can't move and can only attack targets that are inside the area. Passive skill A stack is applied to the enemy each time Ixia deals damage with her basic attacks and skills. Once the enemy has 2 stacks, the next basic attack will deal extra damage and also heal Ixia based on the amount of damage dealt. If there are multiple enemies in front of her with 2 stacks, she can activate the passive with a single basic attack just like this. Laning tips. At the start, prioritize her first skill as this will help you clear lanes faster. The cooldown will also become lower as you level it up. Upgrade ultimate when available, while your second skill have the least priority. Just like any marksman, her early game will be a struggle. Avoid confrontations at the start and reserve your second skill to stun enemies that will try to gank you. It can also be used to push enemies that come too near. Her first skill is also good for escaping as it gives 40% movement boost and can also slow targets. If you want to recover HP fast, you can line up the minions with her first and second skill, followed by a basic attack. This will give you 3 heals coming from her passive. Item build. This is my recommended build for Ixia. I chose attack speed instead of critical because her passive damage can't deal critical hits. Corrosion Side is extremely helpful in slowing down enemies during her ultimate state, and the attack speed it gives makes up for slow attack animation. I didn't include Golden Staff because she doesn't have any skill that can benefit its unique passive. And this is my emblem build. It's custom marksman using Swift as the tier 1 talent. Pull yourself together is used to lower the cooldown of Flicker as well as the active skill Wind Chant. For tier 3, it's Weakness Finder so that I can inflict more slow during my ultimate. Skill combo! A basic combo will be skill 2 followed by skill 1 and then a basic attack to activate the passive. Skill 2 is used first because it has a short delay before it activates. For a full combo, you can start with your ultimate, skill 2, skill 1, and then basic attacks to finish the enemy. If you want to reposition during her ultimate, using flicker is also effective. Ixia is a team-dependent marksman because of the range and damage of her ultimate. Good positioning is very important since she can't move during her ultimate state. Never initiate with your ultimate unless you have the advantage because it makes you an easy target. Despite having CC immunity, she can easily be bursted down if the enemies get near. Use her ultimate preferably behind a wall so that the enemies can reach during team fights. She's bad at 1 versus 1, so avoid it as much as possible. Ixia can choose lifesteal on her basic attacks, but the stat can be used to increase her damage. I think she's the first hero that has a lifesteal stat scaling. And even though she can't have lifesteal, her sustain is quite strong because of her passive skill. You can feel it during her ultimate when you can activate her passive multiple times. You have slain an enemy. Synergies. Ixia works well with allies that have set capabilities. Examples are Atlas, Tigril, and Carmilla. They can hold the enemy while you release her ultimate from a distance. 
Another problem with Ixia is her limited mobility, making her an easy target for assassins. And that's why it's recommended to have an ally that can protect you. Diggy, Franco, and Minotaur are heroes that can peel for you. Eve's ultimate is also a good pair as it can slow the enemies in a spot, allowing you to easily land your ultimate. And there you have it guys. So what can you say about the new hero Ixia? Can she compete with the other meta marksmen? Share your thoughts in the comment section. Stay safe and thank you for watching.